Around 8.30 this morning, Mike Panakis walked into an automotive body shop at the intersection of Moreland and Key Roads. Panakis didn't find the usual workers inside. Instead, he spotted a man with a gun. And I, I come right behind him, you know, so he put the rifle on me. I left, I went across the Waffle House. And he pulled the rifle on you? Yeah. And you ran and called police? Yeah, I called the police. Of him. You're lucky. <laughs> I know. I don't know what was happening. I, th I thought they killed the guys and said he was dead, you know. I thought maybe he was dead or something. So. Police arrived, including the Atlanta SWAT team. They fired several canisters of tear gas into the shop. The man, who was alone, finally gave up, falling to the ground. Besides an overdose of tear gas, the suspect was also given a reminder that the officers weren't in the mood for any resistance. The unidentified man was frisked, then put into a patrol car. A later check shows that he may have also been involved in some early morning robberies in southeast Atlanta. This ordeal was over. No one was injured. Police say this suspect is lucky because he's alive. Because earlier they had spotted him inside the store several times. They could have shot him. Ernie Bjorkman, Action News.